going. Okay. Okay. Hi! I'm Emily. And mm -hmm. I'm Leah. Yeah, and we're going to talk about all about middle school. And basically all you need to know. And yeah, but again, try to condense it all into a short video. I don't know. It's not going to be showing it, maybe a little bit long. But we could go all day about this. So, first topic. What do you want to talk about? Sixth grade. Sixth grade was the best. You will love it. <laughs> it's really easy. I mean, yeah. you're just getting out of elementary school, so they're not too hard on you. Um, mm -hmm. The dress code, a lot of times the school will have a separate dress code for the sixth graders because you're really just now getting used to it. At least that's how it was at my local school. Um, yeah, always be in dress code because it's so, like, embarrassing when you're on dress code because they're going to be like, you're not in dress code and you need to go to the office and call your parents. Yeah, and then you have to walk in the hall, like this long hall walk, and then you're going to like see like this really cute guy and he's going to think like, oh my gosh, did she just get in trouble? And you're like, yeah, I kind of did. Uh, and you're just going to be like this. Um, I'm not doing anything. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <clears throat> so, then we had that one teacher who didn't like like do anything. anything. Yeah, her name this was, was Blakeman. She was my science teacher. She was the best. She didn't even talk about like things relating to the curriculum. We just talked about anything. It was really awesome. It was indeed. Yeah. But then she retired and now she's like a real estate agent. <laughs> but hey, also we guys we went to the last class. So um let's see. Mm -hmm. Makeup. Wow. You will most likely start learning makeup in sixth grade. Well, some people start seventh, some people start eighth, some people don't even learn it now. But the basics, like, you know, foundation, mascara, eyeshadow. Do you know what a blue eyeshadow? <laughs> okay, even so you in sixth grade, I had an obsession with, like, green eyeshadow. Oh, that was a horrible time for me. Yeah. Don't do what I did. Yeah. <laughs> um... Wear matching clothes, not matchy matchy like pink and pink, but like wear clothes that match. Mm -hmm. Because I didn't. <laughs> I, no, I I still don't always because who matches? I'm not wearing anything matching now. Yeah. <laughs> but <laughs> okay, seventh grade. Seventh grade is a little bit harder than sixth grade, obviously. Um, mm -hmm. It's still awesome. I loved it. Um, by the way, in middle school, you will switch classes if you haven't yet, most likely. Because I don't think there's any middle school that doesn't. Unless you go to, like, maybe a Montessori, I think you might not. But, I don't know. It depends on, like, if you live in an urban area, do you live in a mill. It all depends on that. But, um, see, so you school will most likely have a cell phone policy. On any policy saying, like, hey, even put away your Kindle. Hey, put away your neck. Hey, put away your iPad. Anything. So, um, keep it away. I still got out my phone, even though there was a cell phone policy, because I just wanted to. I still had it underneath my desk and stuff. Sometimes you can get away with that, sometimes you can't. I actually never got my phone taken away, which is kind of surprising, because I was on it all the time. <laughs> yeah, bottom line, stay off of it, because if you do get caught, it's going to be so embarrassing, you know. And I saw a lot of people get caught before in my classes. Um, make really good friends in middle school. Don't make friends with, like, the, the bad kids. In quotes, bad kids, like. Yeah. The bad kids are people, like, like, you could think of, like, an acronym in, like, sad, sex, alcohol, or drugs. Do not hang out with those people. Because they're just going to bring you down, and... You might face jail time <laughs> or just because of the decisions well, you made. Some people at my school have faced jail time because of it. Yeah. Well, you know. <laughs> so it is what it is. So stay out of that. Focus on new studies. Do not like don't even like mess don't with the guys. Don't procrastinate because I procrastinated a lot and Same. you will procrastinate no matter what. You time. will, but it's not good. Yeah. Don't make a habit of it. Yeah. So boys. Oh, gosh. Stay out of the boys. Please do. Okay, so there was this one guy friend that I was friends with since sixth grade, or I was friends with. And, um, yeah, I liked him, and we were, like, best friends. And then, um, 
Let's see what happened after that. In eighth grade, we started get, getting into lots of arguments, and yeah, and now we're like enemies, and yeah, yeah, it's sad. So just try to avoid that. Boy, that yeah, just try to avoid that. I never, I never had boyfriends, but you know, I've had guy friends, and yeah. I mean, avoid the guys who like everybody. Yes, avoid there will those. be guys who um, act like they like you and ask you and they to don't. have a girlfriend and they don't really like you. Yeah, that happened a lot to me. Mhm. Mm so just stay out of that because then people might think like, hey, like, ugh. <laughs> um, don't be a bully. That's kind of self-explanatory. Yeah, you you gonna learn about bullying. All the time. Join a sport. Yeah, yeah. Joining yeah. sports do, do will split. be really beneficial for you because you'll make lots of new friends. Hey, you can make lots of new friends. And if you have trouble gaining weight, then chances are you can not gain as much weight. And plus, it's a healthy way. So it's really good. So, you know, sports is all good. We both did track and cross country. Woo! High five. <laughs> yeah, it's really fun. So you can do any sport you want, you know. And it's all fun. I mean, if you Most like it, more fun. Most of them. I mean, I mean, especially when your crush is on the football team and you get to run around with him. I know that's the best part. Cause in, cause in cross country, like I crush is in the fo in the football team, and so like the football field is like here, and then the cross country course is like around the football yeah. field. Yeah. So that was, was so very awesome. motivational. It was very motivational. Yeah. Yeah, and then one time I was like sick at practice, and um, him and one of his friends, like the next day, were like, "I saw you running in cross country." And I was like, "I was sick, so I wasn't running very well." <laughs> that was horrible. Yeah, <laughs> the girl talk. You will start to play in middle school most likely, but you know, it's not that big of a deal because a lot of people think it's a bigger deal than it is because you do not feel it, and you'll get used to it. So just don't wear like. White jeans. Yeah, don't wear white leggings. I've had some pretty bad experiences with that. Um, yeah, stay out of that. I guess. Find people with the same interests as you. Yeah. If you like a band, let's say One Direction, I like One Direction. Find friends who like One Direction so you can talk about them with each other. Yay! Um, we actually don't have any similar interests except we barely like, have any similar. Maybe like neon trees or something, but that's it. <laughs> And the people we like. Yeah. I mean, not really. Opposite of Trinette. <laughs> not in that way. Just <laughs> <laughs> in I know. But. Anything else we need to talk about? It's eighth grade. Eighth grade. Your chance is always going to have. In eighth grade, you're going to have a lot of fun activities planned. From my local school, we did ceiling tiles and we did like a really crappy old walk on the middle of it. Like, huh? <laughs> And then, like, on the same point, and then we put our names, hand pants. It was really fun. Um, let's see. And if you do do ceiling tiles, then do with people if you want to. Well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we kind of because up. we kind of, um, well, it w we did our ceiling tile with the guy I was friends with because I was begging her to let him do it with us. And mm -hmm. since I liked him, like, a lot... She was like, okay, sure, and then we got into those fights, and we were like enemies by the end of it, and it was pretty horrible. Yeah, and then we took a lo and then we took a trip to our little local amusement place. That was really fun, kind of like a fan except inside. So you're gonna do fun things. You might go to the movies. Uh, you might, you might go, go to Fort Harris. Well, no, not Fort Harris. We you might, might go, go to, to the educational field trips. Yeah, you're gonna probably go to your local metro place, like. If like if you live in California, you might go to like the closest biggest city, like San Diego, and whatnot, and maybe the class will just walk in. We live in Kentucky, so I'm moving in like four days. <laughs> yeah, I've known her since fourth grade. She's been really good. Yeah, stick with the elementary school friends. They know you best because it's kind of it's kind of hard to make friends in middle school unless you're like the new kid. And trust me, the new kids. Will be annoying. It's that most of so them. So you're saying I'll be annoying at my new school. How rude. Well, How no, rude. I'm saying most of them. Yeah, we got in trouble for talking a lot. So no, don't more like I got in trouble because I yeah. got in front of her and I was like in front of the teacher's desk and she was always like, Leah, turn around. Leah, do this. Stop talking, Leah. I was just like, 
I'm not the one talking though. Yeah. <laughs> but but just mm. keep quiet. Um, do good on you. And they start calling the test at the new finals, which I didn't get used to that because I was like, what the heck is the final? I don't know what a final is. They didn't. They don't start using finals until eighth grade, really. They're gonna use it a lot more in high school, I think. But in seventh grade, they introduce it to you. What else did we talk about? Um, I think that's pretty much it. Half fun in middle school. Don't stress um as much as I did. Read a lot of wiki how I to post too. They're gonna help that I did yeah. that a lot. Get all your school supplies done. Get Early. pretty school supplies. Decorate them if you want, but uh maybe I do lock a combination. You might want to practice on little locks so you don't like make a fool of yourself. Which I did. So. Yeah. I did too. Okay, so I think that's pretty much it. Have fun in middle school, and I wish you good luck. Good luck. Bye. High five for class of 2019. Woo! And you guys will be class of... Something. I don't know. Okay. 2023. I thought 22. I don't know. I don't know. Something around there. I don't know. Well, bye.